Hello everyone and welcome back to Okami HD. I'm Tenille. And I'm Sean. Last time we talked to this guy and restored a bit of, well, and restored uh, Taka Pass. Mm-hmm. Go out to this corner again. I think there's like an animal here. Mm, no? No, there's oh. a sign. Right to Sasa Sanctuary, straight to City Checkpoint. Hmm, okay. And there's this sign here, too. To Sasa Gate. Legend has it that a beautiful sanctuary awaits good-hearted people who pass through this gate. Hmm. hmm. Interesting. Well, I think I'm going to ignore that for now. <laughs> <laughs> You're just like, nah. Or should I? I think you should show it off. We kind of teased people last episode. That's a good point. We should go, we should, we, we should see if we can figure it out. <laughs> figure it out. Yeah. Hmm. First though, ever so important, gotta feed the animals. Feeding animals. Very, very important. All, All right. right. So, uh. What this guy missed is he needs to pass under the gate. <laughs> or he might just not be good hearted enough. I really love this effect though. Mm-hmm. Like. Going through the gate takes you to another world. Yeah, it's so It's just cool. another example of this. We already talked about this earlier. Uh-huh. But, yeah, whenever you see a gate, if you pass under it, it will take you to somewhere else. Mm-hmm. In this case, Sasa Sanctuary. Bamboo Village, Sasa Sanctuary. Mmm, <laughs> don't you just love the smell of bamboo? Looks like there's a road here. Let's see where it takes us. Sure thing. Yeah, so we found a little side area. Huh. Got this little building here. Oh, can you get up there? Sure yes. can. Oh ho! There's two layers. I forgot there was. <laughs> it's all the way up here. And it's a clover! Huh. There you go. All right. Hey, 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 chirp. Hey, you, Scruffy, what are you doing in Sasha's sanctuary? Skipping in here with that little, with that instant look on your face. You have a lot of noise for a, for a wolf. You know, this is the turf of the Sparrow Clan, right? We can't just let you turn around and leave. Oh, no. Well, Dan, you're hiding and send you back in. Boss, let this cocky mutt have it. Uh-oh. Oh, no. That is a very fat sparrow. Hey, Scruffy, do you even know who this is? This is the mighty leader of the Sparrow Clan. That's right, the Great Jumba. Big Daddy Jumba. Oh, Daddy. Okay, boss, take it away. He's all yours. Choip. Uh-oh. The boss is seriously angry. What the heck is going on here? <laughs> Listen up, Scruffy. The boss's precious daughter's been kidnapped, and he's mad. We're doing everything we can to find her. We've searched all over. But no one's getting through that gate unless she's safe and sound. So go on, off with ya. Oh. Bye. Okay. Toodles. I, I thought you weren't letting us go. Huh? They're not gonna let us in? And what was that about their boss's daughter being kidnapped? Well, we're not wanted here. <laughs> That was, um, that was a thing. <laughs> yeah, so we can't really do anything else there for now. Right now, which is why I considered not even going, but I was like, you know, it's better to just go. Go, show it off. Mm-hmm. Let people experience that. How about... It? There we go. Keep it day. Yeah, keep it day daylight, please. Mm-hmm. This is new. Yeah. 
I mean, it does have the cracked symbol on it, which we often use bombs for. But that doesn't seem to be the case here. Yeah. We'll have to come back to it later. Good job. There you go. That was one EXP. Well... <gasps> Ooh! Oh, I made the foxes happy! Oh wait, here, can you guys eat fish? Oh... No. Foxes should be able to eat fish! Riot! <laughs> We're out of meat. Crap. We need to get more meat. Yeah. I'm sure we'll have the chance soon. Hey, guy. Bingo. There, there, there! There it is! My pendulum's calling out to me. The treasure must be buried here. What are you staring at, pooch? Want to help me dig up the treasure? My pendulum's showing me where it was. But I've completely lost track of where that was now. There must be some kind of clue around here somewhere. Hmm. Hmm. It might be under I'm, this pile I'm of leaves. I'm guessing it's, it's here. But uh, we can't do anything about that right now. We are completely beaten Hacha. by leaves. Oh. oh, there's a tree back there. My circles are so nice, but I'm not connecting the ends. There we go. Yeah, and unless you connect the ends, it don't matter. Here we go. A demon gate. Take him out. Get out. Get out. Oh, you only got the one. That's all right. Now they'll be less likely to both be on me at the same time. No. Nope. No, no, no. Uh. Get back! Oh, you got him! Oh, come on! Hit! Yes, Demon Fang! Huzzah! Finally got a st oh! Scribble, scribble, scribble! Oh, ouch! He's wailing on you. Yeah. No. Nope. Oh, one more hit. Hit! <laughs> There we go. Not too bad. Yeah. Probably not gonna do great on damage though. Yeah, definitely not. You still got yeah. hit once or twice. Please don't be a meat eater. Oh good, it's deer. <laughs> no more tigers or dogs or foxes. For now at least. We need to go get more meat. Meat. Nom 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 nom. Feeding the deer. I am curious how many deer we have left, or like what our percentage is for deer. Mm hmm. You uh, should check. Let's see. Animal tome. Animal tome. We've gotten foxes and tigers. Wow, we fed two tigers and we already have 22%. Yeah. Deer, 79. 79. Okay. So we still have a few. All right. So, do you want to go to the next area? Hmm? No, I, I'm not gonna go there. Okay. We're gonna leave that. Because similar to Sasa Sanctuary, it's not really gonna get us anywhere. And there's not really any, like, funny cutscene that happens either, so... You are doing amazing, honey. Thank you. I'm trying real hard. Tree? Thank you! <laughs> oh, at least it gave me 11 for all that effort it went through. Oh, that's amusing. Still haven't found the source of this water. Yep. Which doesn't exist. Oh, chest. Diggy, diggy, dig! Open it up. Holy uh, bone. Holy bone. Okay. Not that we've really used any sort of healing items yet. Yeah, we might need them later. Yep, it's true. Well, hello, lady. L lady? Goodbye, lady. Oh. I gotta take care of demon gates. I guess, but this might solve her problem. No. 
Okay. Are, are you gonna fight it? You're just gonna run away from it? I was waiting for him to do a thing, but he didn't do anything. I was wondering if your circle was actually gonna work. Yeah, same. There you go. I was about to say, now my circles won't work. Huh, scribble! Wow, that immediately landed him. One more. Oh, man. No! Oh! oh, you jerk! Just wait for him to come up and hit him once. He'll die. That is if you can hit them. <laughs> I got him. I got him. It's all good. Run in circles, run in circles, run in circles. Woo! Oh, he did poorly on time, then. It did solve the water crisis. Well, yeah, it solved the water crisis, but not her problem. Man, that's we got we got so much. Oh, and more more deer. Feed the deer. <laughs> Feed the deer. <laughs> that's a bit of a reach, hun. Feeding, feeding, feeding the deer. All right, what's up, lady? It's so wonderful that the mermaid spring has come back to life. Maybe it's thanks to the legendary power of the mermaids. Have you heard the story? This spring's like a path for them. Sometimes they come up from the bottom of the ocean. There are other springs just like this all over Nepal. The mermaids come up to the ground to visit their favorite places. See, part of the water's surface is shining faintly. If you throw a mermaid coin in there, the path will open up. Yeah. That, I that's guess that's it. it. Oh, uh, take you to loved ones, or I mean, never mind. <laughs> Okay. <gasps> yeah, so she's talking about the symbol in there, which we've actually seen before. Yeah, so that if is... we find a mermaid coin, we might be able to use it to travel. Mermaid spring. See that light? This is a special place known as a mermaid spring. There's a wonderful legend about beautiful mermaids appearing here. They say that there are other mermaid springs throughout the land. You should visit them whenever they may, wherever they may be. Sounds good. Got it. Okay. Let's see, you were kind of down this way. Yep. Yeah. I fed a dog here. I fed a dog here once. He was pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. Pretty chill. Oh! <gasps> Meat! Yay! Good stuff. That's what we need. Another cat statue. Can't do anything about. To Kusa Village. Well, Maybe how we about head we up head up, up that way? Yeah. Exactly. Ooh, monkeys. Uh, monkeys. Can eat anything. Fish? Yeah, eat the fish. No one else will eat the fish. We're running out of other things, so eat the fish. I mean, we still have plenty of uh, herbs. Yeah. Plants. Plant life. Yes, please. More seeds. Man, this is uh, quite the climb. Oh, yeah. Up, 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 Ooh. up. Look at that. That does not look good. Oh, yeah, it doesn't look clean and clear. Hmm. Yeah, this place just looks kind of uh Oh, look at our ink bar. Yikes! What's this creepy at evil atmosphere in this village? There's no curse zone here, but I definitely sense evil. Oh, geez, you're right. There we go. Our ink is just slowly draining. <laughs> save us, save point! <sighs> okay. Evolve a look. I wanted to do some trading over at the Gale Shrine, but it's been taken over by some monster and it's panic all around. Oh well, I suppose I'll just have to make the best of it now. 
Have you been sent here to do some shopping for your mister? Yes. Yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay! <laughs> Hello! Look at all this stuff! So... Infinity Judge. Reflector marked indelibly with the loop of infinity. Judge is evil. Pinwheel, which is what we've been sent to buy yeah. by the guy. And some gold dust. Cool. Those all sound amazing. And then we might actually want to pick up some... Uh, Feed bags, Feed yeah. bags with what we've got left. Oh, he's got more than one. He's got two. Boom. So we'll get that. All right, get some meat. We have seven of those, seven of those, one of those. We'll do that. All right, yeah, that seems that seems like a good amount. And we Nothing don't have anything to sell. to sell. So yeah, there seems to be some evil stagnation here that is causing our... Uh, MP to slowly drain. You should power that up also. Oh, I love how that one looks on the menu. Mm-hmm. Just like back out, look there at that. There you go, ah, oh, <laughs> yeah. Exploding into pieces. And, once and we while get out we here, still have it. Oh, uh, it's so cool. All right. It's probably one of the coolest uh, looking shields. No good, Furball. Your celestial brush ain't gonna work in evil power this strong. So, we can't use our brush. That's problematic. You know, the priest at the shrine was gobbled up by that monster. I'm sure that what's... I'm sure that's what stopped the divine wind from blowing. Monsters have been attacking the Gale Shrine, you see. The strength of the Shrine God is growing weaker and weaker. The divine wind used to make the windmill there t turn like a charm. But that's not all. Yes? Speaking of the priest, Princess Fuse is quite admirable. It's, l it's long been their family's duty to protect the Shrine, you know. Though all alone now, she still perseveres, shedding nary a tear. It's a shame no one does anything to help her out, don't you think? Anyhow. How much longer is this going to go on? Kusa Village is famous all over it for its divine wind, and yet now it's stopped blowing and we're in a terrible mess. That wind is our livelihood and the air is foul without it. Oh, is it really nothing that can be done? Come to think of it. Yes. That descendant of Nagis is supposed to be here, isn't he? Uh-oh. Great. Susano's here to save the day. Maybe he'll take care of that monster for us. I'm sure the wind will come back if only that monster was gone. At least, I hope so. Hmm. Gossiping women. Let's go in here. Ugh, the curse is in here, too. What now, a wolf? Another non-paying customer is all I need. That guy who came the other day has been a complete disaster. I let him stay because he claims to be the descendant of Nagi. But he's hardly a monster killer. He sleeps in the woods all day. And he makes awful noise, crying out in his sleep at night. Maybe you could try chasing him off for me. Crying sounds out in his sleep at night. That sounds awful. That Daruma looked like it was missing an eye. Well, unfortunately, I don't have any ink to do anything about it. Hmm, that is true. Because, yeah. <laughs> Just kind of powders. But I do like how you can just bang everything open. Eek! <laughs> First, can't you wait until I'm done? <laughs> wow, Tanil. <laughs> oh, oh, and we're White Wolf now. We have run out of ink. Oh, and look. See how it's all dead? Oh. The grass and the leaves. Yeah. Can we jump now? Bark, bark. We just a dog now. You don't get to see us as just the white wolf very often. So this is cool. Yeah. 
Anything behind here? Nope. All right. Uh, uh, no, no, not that. By the gods, I vowed to, mm, you won't ever, mm, mm. Hmm? It's Asano. He's one tenacious dude. Wonder what he's doing here. I bet he's having a nightmare about getting beat up by monsters. He seems rather frantic. It'd be funny if, you, if it weren't so sad. That dream again. Is there no escape? I thought by coming to the village. Hey there, Pops. Floundering around in your dreams, too? Must be nice to be able to nap in the middle of the day like that. Greatest warrior ever, my foot. Hmm? Poochie. And a little bug? <clears throat> oh, uh, cough, cough. <clears throat> Here to disturb my meditation again? Even in my dreams, I'm hard at work devising strategies for defeating that crimson something or other. I came here to pray for victory at, Ga at the Gale Shrine, but uh, lo and behold, that crimson something or other occupies the shrine. Well, with my invincible sword, there's no need to pray, but mankind's fate rests with me. I must be fully prepared. First, I must sit here and come up with a well-thought-out plan. Hmm. Now, where was I? Plan? Yeah, right. You're just an excuse to sleep. That's just an excuse to sleep. You're just an excuse to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so it's been rough, huh, Susano? Can't a fella get some sleep? Oh, it's you again. I'm devising a plan. Thought I'd pray. Drinking some Akushi sake would be great. <laughs> bah, he's not only a coward, but a lush, too. What? A lush, someone who drinks. Oh, okay. A drunkard! Well, there's a clover I can't do, do anything, anything with. About. Okay. Well. Another one up there. there. Man, we can't run here. fast either. Eh. Yeah. Hmm. Sorry, what a pickle I'm in. Hmm. Oh, what a cute wolf. I'm in a pickle right now, Wolfie. I'm a craftsman and I work with bamboo, as you can see. But I can't get any work done on work. I, I can't, hold on. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't burden you with my problems, Wolfie. I'm getting all flabbergasted with my words. Oh. Words are hard. <laughs> wow, Sean, this is you as, as an old man. <laughs> Boy, that must be some big pickle if you're con confiding in a wolf. <laughs> I can't do these voices with you laughing at me. <laughs> Hello there, little sprite. Here to listen to an old man's ramble. I always gather bamboo over in Sasa Sanctuary in Taka Pass. But I haven't been able to get in there lately. The Sparrow Clan suddenly closed the entrance to Sasa Sanctuary. Oh, how, do I, how I do wish I could craft my bamboo ware. I am an old man and it's all I have left. To make matters worse, the festival's just around the corner. I usually sell my work there, but I'm running out of time. Ah, uh, it, ain't, it, ain't, it ain't the end of the world, Gramps. What have we got ourselves mixed up in now, Ami? Hmm. Hmm. If only There's we could... some glowing bamboo we can't do anything with because we don't have our powers. We can't chop a thing. Hey, I can dig, though. And smash things with my head. And get stray beads. Yeah. Yes. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> More bamboo sprouts. Eh. Yum. All right. All right, yep. All right, see you later, Mr. Bamboo. We'll probably be helping you out later, as soon as we can. If I can get across this bridge. Mm -hmm. I think we need to figure out this cursed situation first. Yep.
Can you get up there? Yes, yes, you can. Yeah, but oh. this isn't really anything I can do deal with. Yeah. We need ink. We need ink power. We can't even make the sun shine. No. Not that you could really see it here. Yeah. Blossom. Man, oh man, we walk so slow. <laughs> that being said, this is a very interesting layout for a village. Mm -hmm. Just like on the side of a cliff face with yeah. all these paths and stuff. It's really cool. If only we could do more. Yeah. Exactly what you said. Oh. Hmm. Oh, this is most unfortunate. I have been possessed in a momentary lapse of vigilant in vigilance. And I was trying so hard to defend this village. Now it shall be reduced to a horrid curse zone. Jeez, every single pretty lady that just bemuses sadness, you're just gonna use like the same voice for, aren't you? Well, because they're all like so dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> Alas, my strength it wanes! All is lost! I mean, like, how can you not? <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. Ooh, it's a new demon. It flies. Hmm, I can't fly. This might be a problem. Yeah, you also have no ink powers. Nope. Now you might be thinking, don't we have like some ink restorative items? Yes, yes we do, but they do nothing, so yeah. don't waste them. Uh, no, I won't, but I could use something like this. Yes. Since we've never used it before. So this will slightly damage nearby enemies. Kaboom. Boom. And by slightly, it completely killed the one and knocked the other one out of the air. Yeah, so it's good stuff. Man, we're just biting this guy. I there love the, the wolf foo. Yeah. Yeah. Ami's um, kicks in the air. <laughs> uh, that's great. That's some good stuff. Hmm. Yes. Ah. <gasps> You've cured it. Hmm. Have I been freed from the evil curse? You have saved me, but I do not know how. What the heck happened, sweetness? Oh, are you a familiar with my fam? Are you familiar with my family, the Satomi House? No, I can see now that you are not. Still, you may be of great service to me yet. Will you not listen to what I have to say? You just keep talking, pretty lady. Isun's listening. Ugh. <laughs> Oh, thank you. I'm Princess Fuse, the priestess of the Gale Shrine. Princess Fuse. The Gale Shrine stands atop Mount Kamiji. Kazegame. Kazegame, the god of the wind, is enshrined there. The wind blowing down from there keeps the monsters away. Known as the Divine Wind, it is venerated as our protector. However, it suddenly stopped blowing one day. And that has allowed the monsters to sneak into our village. Even I, the last remaining priestess here, was nearly slain. That horrible monster is behind all of this. Yes, go on. Will you hear the rest of my story? There's only one explanation for why the Divine Wind stopped. It is that horrible monster, Crimson Helm. Something or other. <laughs> the beast now dwells within the Gale Shrine. The monsters in this area have all been under Crimson Helm's control ever since he appeared in Taka Pass a hundred years ago. Hmm, a hundred years ago. Hmm, we know something else that happened a hundred years ago. Yeah. My people, the Satomi House, Keepers of the Gale Shrine, have been battling the beast and his minions ever since. But last year, the fiends attacked and killed the head priest while he was weakened by sickness, and the Gale Shrine fell into their hands. I remember hearing that story. It was big news in these parts. 
If only I could vanquish Crimson Helm and free the Gale Shrine, but I'm no match for the evil barrier that now bars entry. There's only one hope now. Only the warriors who serve the Satomi House can right this wrong. Hmm. Warriors, you say? Yes. Um, we might have to find out who these warriors are next time. Oh. On Okami HD. So see you guys then.